One UI 7 has no dynamic island. Yes, you heard it right. The new Samsung One UI 7 update was rumored to include a feature similar to Apple's dynamic island because of a leak. However, a well-known tipster named Ice Universe posted on Twitter that the elliptical shapes in the status bar, which made people think Dynamic Island was coming to One UI 7.0, are just notifications and nothing else. In One UI 6, there was just one elliptical element for call notifications. In One UI 7, Samsung will probably use this design for other apps like the stopwatch, music, and recording. Ice Universe said that he doesn't think Samsung is copying Apple's design and that they are creating their own style. Samsung's eagerly awaited One UI 7.0 operating system will start beta testing on July 29th. Now let's talk about some previous live leaks of One UI 7.0. The Galaxy S24 Ultra will be among the first to receive the update, and there's good news. Samsung is working on significantly improving the camera experience. According to Ice Universe, One UI 7.0 will optimize several shooting modes for the Galaxy S24 Ultra. The source claims that the 1X and 5X 50 megapixel modes for the primary and telephoto cameras, respectively, will offer the same picture quality as Pixel Bin 12 megapixel photos. Capturing photos in the 12 megapixel Pixel Bin mode with the Galaxy S24 Ultra generally delivers better clarity, colors, and dynamic range. With One UI 7.0, the Galaxy S24 Ultra's 1X 50 megapixel primary mode and 5X 50 Megapixel telephoto mode are expected to match that level of detail and quality. After last week's leaks of redesigned icons for some of Samsung's stock apps, there's a new leak from SmartPricks and ex-user Chun Bai showing more design changes in One UI 7.0. The images reveal One UI 7.0's new quick panel design and a more rounded overall look. The quick panel is now split into two sections, quick settings and notifications. You can switch between them by swiping left or right. You can also hide the labels of the quick settings. The new design is more like an improved version of the One UI 6.0 quick panel rather than something copied from iOS, as some rumors suggested. Samsung has also improved the continuity feature, which now lets users send video call notifications to nearby devices. This means you can continue regular or video calls from a Galaxy phone to a Galaxy tablet or a Samsung TV nearby, as long as both devices are signed in with the same Samsung account. Notifications now look more rounded and have more space between them. Are you excited for the One UI 7.0 update? That's it for today. What are your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comment section. As always, see you in the next video. Peace out.